Ball movement, the high left side. Josh the Bills works across the end line over the top. He got into the lane. Oh, oh, he laid it in. Oh, My name is uh, Randy Dominic Baker. Nickname is Shake, and I'm 50 years old. Yes, uh, David Myers, I'm 50 years old. My name is David Cuevas Jr., and I am 69 years old. No, actually, I, I played all through high school, and then after high school, didn't play at all till five years ago. I played high, uh, basketball in high school at Bel Air High School, and most of the guys that are playing together, we're all from Bel Air. We decided to get a team together, and play here. St. Andrews College and I went to Francis Marion, both of them um, Division II schools in uh, North Carolina and South Carolina. That's my history of basketball is that I love it to death. I was invited by the same team that I'm playing with right now about six, seven years ago. The thing that brought me back is uh, when I played basketball in the military, I met a group of guys and we played together since 95 called the Bad Boys. I started in this league as a accidentally I used to play softball. My team faded away a little bit in the week. Just came in and signed up and picked up some uh, gentlemen from work. And we developed a friendship. I go deploy, come back, deploy, come back, to a point that I said, I want to stay here and, and be a part of this legacy that we built. Next time you know, I've been playing for four years, every Wednesday, just about. I like the teamwork. I like the energy. I like basketball because when I come here, I have fellowship with the, with the guys here. Plus, I enjoy the game very much, more so than watching the game. Just just coming out, enjoying and playing every day. I love the game of basketball. This, it helps me out exercise twice a week. We're running around for 40 minutes. So, as you can see, we're trenched. <laughs> Basketball, it took me around the world, has been a gauge for me of uh, life. At Beller High School, I was young, I wanted to win. Uh, now, my mentality has changed quite a bit. I'm, I'm not as competitive, but I just want to come out here and enjoy myself. Collegiate basketball used to be fun. It's like a job. Here, you come in the gym, hey, how you doing? I miss college, but I love this better. Oh yeah. Back then it used to be a fast game, you know, you have to move and now here with, with the older gentleman here, it's a slower pace. I do it for the exercise and get away from the house. A friend went down, hurt his leg. We all ran to the court. We grabbed him and uh, we said, hey, you okay? I looked around, I'm like, Wow, that's special. I think every, every game that we play is memorable. Even if we lose by two, two or three points, we get, we get excited, you know, because normally we lose by 20 points. <laughs> so. Can you imagine 50 year old guys doing the thing they do now? You do the math. A lot of guys don't do this at 50. They go home and sit. We are here playing basketball on a Wednesday night. There's guys here that are 65, 70 years old. That's 20 years more that I can be playing. <laughs> Hopefully I can last that long. I'm 69 and I hope I can continue playing ball for another five to ten more years. As long as my legs and my ankles help me out, as you can see, I have braces, so I'm like a Robocop. As long as I, my health is good, I'll keep on playing. I think I'm going to keep on playing until my body tells me to stop. It's, I think basketball is kind of therapeutic. A lot of guys that play basketball here, doctors, lawyers, you never know it, but they're truly professionals. But they get here to play basketball court, you don't know what their resume are, who they are, until you really talk to them. And they meant that is a judge. But on the court, it doesn't matter. It's just come right. I told you, right, it's open. Right, it's open. You got nothing down every time, Brad. You whisper nothing. You right here? You point like that. No real, right? Ah. Yeah. Uh, the, the new groups now, I think Curry is, is a very good basketball player. If you really kind of have any kind of heroes, these are the guys right here playing right now behind me. Those are the guys that I think are like my heroes because they're still in there. They need some acknowledgement, not just me, just them. Because some guys are not that good, but they try their best. It inspires everybody else on the court. If he can do it at 50, why can't I? Even though he probably got all this money and stuff, he still gives his best for his team. That's a real life lesson.